Dance Taka Rizuka Review, where girls willingly succumb to a rigid regime of discipline and purity to realize their dreams of Western glamour and male sexuality. A fascinating insight into Japanese spectacle and sensuality. Under the Sun, next Sunday at 8 on BBC Two. Tonight's cult movie drone film stars reggae singer Jimmy Cliff in a tale of frustrated ambition where violence becomes a way out. Life and language in the raw. Tonight on Movie Drome, the ultimate music-related non-rockumentary cult classic, the Saturday late night show par excellence, The Harder They Come, made in 1972 in Jamaica. The film, as you probably know, stars reggae genius Jimmy Cliff in the role of Ivan, an aspiring young Jamaican musician who plans to make it as a reggae star. What do you want? Bring the records for the Rallison. I can't sing to you know, sir. I'd like the chance to make a record. Everybody want to make a record. You almost ready? But I have a boss song, you know, sir. This one must sell. What time is on this? Okay, let's go. What time tomorrow, sir? Tomorrow. It features one of the most exciting musical tracks of any feature film, encapsulating with a selection of really great hits a musical moment, just as Dennis Hopper's Easy Rider and Colors soundtracks did or the Pistols soundtrack for Julian Temple's great rock and roll swindle. The Harder They Come features music by Toots and the Maytals, Jimmy Cliff, Desmond Decker and the Slickers. The songs include Many Rivers to Cross, Johnny Too Bad, You Can Get It If You Really Want, and of course the title track, The Harder They Come. Harder they come, the harder they soundtrack it ranks with American Graffiti, The Big Chill, The Graduate and Midnight Cowboy. Not only does The Harder They Come feature a great soundtrack, it also manages to be a great film as well. The director, Perry Hensel, was a graduate of the BBC. This was his first feature. The Harder They Come is sort of the career of a social bandit like Bonnie and Clyde or Salvatore Giuliano. At the same time, and this is both Cliff's and Hensel's brilliance, there are no false notes no dubious mythologizing. When Ivan is taken to jail, he is scared. He's violent and misogynistic. He has a very romantic notion of himself as a Robin Hood character. At one point, movie drone regulars will note, he goes to see Sergio Corbucci's spaghetti western Django at the Rialto Cinema in Kingston. The film impresses him so much that he actually identifies with Django, aka Franco Nero, in the final showdown. Just come out. Who shut him out? You think you can dance the last wheel? Kids, do not attempt these feats in your own home. Do not become a ganja dealing gangster or a rock and roll musician. Do not drag a Gatling gun around in a coffin, or if you must, avoid gun toting maniacs and fast flowing rivers of mud. Remain glued to your television, unbemused by the distinction between reality and unreality, as Movie Drone presents. The first Jamaican feature film, the first original classic of cult reggae cinema, The Harder They Come. 